Good afternoon and welcome to the Exchange Gallery. My name is Oren Helbach, I'm the director here. The current show is called Images in a Deliberate Sequence. We invited artists to make work inspired by comics or visual storytelling in general. It could be any style, it could be any medium. The show has almost 40 pieces in it by 17 artists from all around Pennsylvania. We have people from six counties in Pennsylvania. Broad age range, there are three students at Bloomsburg University who have work in the, student, in the show now. We also have work by at least four Bloomsburg University graduates. One of the best things about the Exchange Gallery is the broad range of people we attract to bring work in. The way I say it is we open the door to the art world and invite everybody in. It could be a preschool student, could be a Bloomsburg University professor, could be someone who's been showing work their whole life. Their whole life may be four years, but they've been showing their work their whole life and it comes here. One of our regular exhibitors here at the Exchange Gallery is Chet Davis. Chet is a native of the coal region, worked his career as a high school art teacher, and still lives in the area, shows here with some regularity. He is both a painter and a sculptor in this show. The painting here is called Man Without a Country. It's a tribute to the life of Kurt Vonnegut. Kurt Vonnegut had a fairly long and very interesting life. He included his life in his writings, and some of those stories are here in this piece in the show. The two artists in particular deserve credit for this show. Sarah Foster is a 2019 graduate of Bloomsburg University, is a member of our gallery committee here, and she was the one who came up with the idea for the images in a deliberate sequence show. She is a fan of comics and wanted to see what other people would bring on that theme. Gina D'Ignazio, who has three pieces in this show, also a member of the gallery committee, a Cutstown University graduate. Her three pieces in this show are all decoupaged comics on objects. So there's a key in the background. She also did work on a small table and also a storage container. We encourage you to come in and see all of these pieces.